right now pray for anybody here who may experience a sickness I talked to a lady today who came a month ago to our service and she had problem that her bones actually in her hip they were scratching each other so bad that she literally she could not move her hip without an increased intensive pain she actually works is our pastor's wife here Tiluba? she adore us she works with you and she she lives in Kenwick so I talked to her today so after the prayer she's a nurse so you know she understands all this stuff this is not like you know somebody like me who doesn't know much about this and after the prayer she went home she says she her pain immediately decreased it's been a month she has not been taking the medications and they told her to replace they need to replace her hip she says every single day she lives she has less pain she's like I look forward to another day because literally every single day she's like I'm not completely walking like no pain at all but she's like I can bend I can walk and she's like the pain every single day is increasing decreasing decreasing and decreasing and it just brought so much joy to me there was a gentleman who came also last month from Seattle who's actually been given an official doctoral medical report of an anxiety you look at him and he looks as though he lives in a mental institution literally just like beaten just just dead he cannot work because of an anxiety he hears voices he sits I speak speak to him he's like I hear voices in my head right now after that prayer we followed up with him just a few weeks ago he said literally the anxiety is gone he's like he sleeps completely peacefully and he said the voices is gone and he's like so I'm looking forward to maybe start getting back to work and so I was just so excited of what Jesus did in some in that person's life amen now you may not be here today and you hear voices or something but if you have a problem in your back or maybe in your ankles you're going to the doctor we would like to pray for you we believe in Jesus who forgives sin but we also believe in Jesus who heals people amen and we're not afraid to pray for people last Sunday right here there was a gentleman for nine months excruciating back pain it was so severe he could not sleep one night for past nine months without tossing and churning because of the pain and after the prayer we asked him you know to start exercising and start bending and literally he was surprised himself pain was completely gone while he was talking here another lady who received prayer comes at the end and he says hey when he started to do that I decided my daughter pushed me and says hey you came here for 20 years you had back pain check your pain she's like oh yeah that's right 20 years let me try that she tries it she comes after the service she's like hey Pastor Vlad my pain is gone too and so I was like yes Jesus is with us through the Holy Spirit nothing is too hard for God amen is there anybody here who's saying you know what I have a sickness and I would like to pray right now right now that there will come your freedom in Jesus name is it your back is your neck Lord God in the name of Jesus Christ we ask you right now for your peace we ask you right now for your ease and for your healing to come with your sickness to come with your pain in the name of Jesus Christ we pray in Jesus mighty name we pray in the name of Jesus Christ we ask you had a car accident um, last May last Memorial weekend um, I was in a car accident with my sister and I hit my neck really hard and ever since then I've been having really hard um, where I could I couldn't turn my neck I used to wear a brace in the beginning but then it got a little bit better but still even today at work we have our computers a little bit higher so I had to look up and I had neck would cramp up and it was hurting and right now it's gone <laughs> it's, it's gone <laughs> amen